Hey y'all. What's up y'all? I am coming back. This year girl go mouth. Ah, of course. Uh, I'm coming back to show you guys what's under my bonnet. How I woke up with my hair underneath my bonnet the next day after I washed it, shampooed it, deep condition. No, what? Shampoo, color treated with a rinse. I just did a rinse. I would guess you would call this a rinse because it is a semi-permanent. This is the rinse that I use all the time uh, by Clairol Beautiful Collections. Um, advanced gray solutions for gray hair because I have a little bit of gray like right on my edges right here. So this time I only um, color my edges um, because I, I have no need to color the rest, you know, my hair for real because my, my regular hair color is a number one. It is naturally jet black, but then here comes some grays. Be like, hello. And then, um, I remember somebody asked me, did, uh, did my hair turn brown from using this? Gray, yes, the grays in your hair will turn brown from, I believe that's from using any color because they're gray and, you know, they're kind of resistant or whatever, but it's going to stay black until, because it's a rinse. And once you rinse it all out, it's going to, hell y'all, it does that, okay? Don't get me in the color and, and technical stuff, I don't know. But it turns a little bit, did I say gray? I meant to say bronze, like a bronze gold color. But, I just put that black right back on and going about my business. But anyways, I only did the edges. This is the teal bandana bunny. It's available on my website right now. Go to creations.webs.com, baby, okay? So I'm going to turn around and show y'all what my bunny looks like. It's just like the bandana print and it is teal. Okay, y'all? So I'm going to take my hair out of my bunny. I've been asleep all night. I literally just woke up, went to the bathroom, wiped my face, brought my tea. And I said, you know what? Let me do a video for um for y'all to see how I look when I wake up, okay? What's under my bonnet when I wake up after my wash day, okay? So, I'm going to take this bonnet off. <sighs> Ooh, my first time taking it off this morning. And these are the results that I get. As y'all can see, I did not. The only heat that I put in my hair was I blow dried it yesterday with a blow dry comb and... If you saw my last video, you will see what my hair was like big. Y'all was supposed to watch that video to the end, so I hope y'all did, so y'all could see my results. Um, the I think it was like after I watched it, updated version. Okay, so anyway, this is what it looks like straight out of a bonnet. And I am 16 weeks post relaxer. I relax my hair last time when I did my last relax I was 17 weeks post I relaxed my hair earlier the last time that I normally would do it but it don't matter but I'm just letting you know it was I was 17 weeks post the last time I relaxed my hair now I'm currently 16 weeks post and I plan on going to 26 weeks and I will do that with the help of me putting my hair back up in protective styles. Lord, I ain't been able to do no protective styles in 2020, y'all. I mean, I ain't been able to go get my hair done. Because I could have did me some protective styles. But I was just... Ugh. I like to go get my hair done. But, you know, the road, I, we can't be just going up all over a little bit, people. You know, in, up on the people. And get my hair done and stuff. So, anyway, this is what my hair looks like. After being in my blender all night. I'm just going to comb through it so y'all can see that. My comb through. I like to part my hair, like I said, in all, in all my videos when I do this. Because I like to go back and watch my video and really get a good look of what my hair looks like. Underneath, in between my scalp and all of that. Because it's very important that y'all do that. You know, so that way you'll know if you got any problem area that you need to work on or whatever. Um, to part through your hair and get a good look at it, especially in the back. Because that nape area back there, y'all, is real sensitive. So, you want, you want to make sure you just pay attention to your hair through your journey, okay? Just pay attention to your hair. And I mean all your hair. Part it through. Look at it. Look at it all through there. Look at this part up on the hills. Make sure you ain't having no breakage that you don't know about. You know, 
a breakage can hide from you, y'all, if y'all don't go in there and dig through. Breakage can hide. Especially that nape area. That nape area breakage be hiding. The next thing you know, you, you ain't got no hair back there when you could have prevented it a long time ago. Like what happened to me, child. But, just want to go through and see the short parts of your hair. I won't know until I go back and watch this video. But, uh, let me, let me look. Let me do something else. Okay. This was one of my problem areas before. This back here. Oh, my nape. Okay. Oh, God. So, I hope y'all seeing me. Okay. So, <clears throat> I'm going I'm to do this with my hands because comb is, I need to check on my nape area. So when I come back and watch this video, you know, I can see how the back of my hair is doing or not doing. Okay. How many of y'all been following me long enough to remember the back of my hair was gone pretty much? Yeah, so I'm going to. Y'all have to dissect y'all hair, man. I'm telling you, dissect it. I mean, go in it and, you know, check for short pieces and any possible signs of any breakage. That's what I'm doing now. So I'm going to come back and watch this video. And then I'll be able to know, you know, what I need to work on, if I need to work on anything, you know. Because the back of your hair back here, I'm telling y'all, that breakage can't happen. Okay, somewhere or another, my, it's, it cut off. So, oh Lord, this is a life camera action. All right. So, that's what my hair is looking like. Oh, my God. My lights are so bright. My lights are so bright right now. Fresh out of the bunny. So, I'm going to go back and look at this video because I think I got a little problem area right there, girl. I don't know. I don't think it's at the scalp. I think it's just like piece. It's shorter. Uh, I could have been like that. I ain't know. But now I know, you know, what's what and all of that stuff. So, um, I think I already spoke enough in the rest of this video, y'all. But anyway, y'all, that's me dissecting my hair. Um, make sure y'all go through y'all hair. And make sure y'all check out my website and get y'all abundant so y'all can keep up with y'all hair journey. And keep that hair moisturized and sealed just a little while longer, okay? Protect those ends, okay, y'all? Thank you guys so much for watching. I will leave all the information to my website below as always. Alright? And that's all I got to say in this video. And oh, let me shake it for y'all. Let me shake, 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 shake. And that's all I got to say in this video. <laughs> and I will holler at y'all later. Bye.